think you should What's up, Jet Riders? It's your girl, Justine, and I'm back with another video. What's up, guys? Today is, what is today? Oh, today is Wednesday, November 9th, and I'm at Starbucks, guys. This is my second time going to Starbucks this week, and this is probably going to be it. Last week, I went to Starbucks. I think it was, did I go one time? I really cut Starbucks down. Because I don't really want it to make it part of my morning routine, going every morning to Starbucks. Plus, I'm cutting back, trying to watch my weight. It's a lot of things I have to take into consideration, plus my pockets. So, I'm trying to see how much I spend this week in um, Starbucks. Because I want to be... I want to be reasonable with myself and I want to give myself a spending allowance for Starbucks every week and I think I might make it well this is my second day I think I might give myself a $20 a week spending allowance for Starbucks which I think about that because I think that's a marvelous idea and that way I can save some money plus look at my eyes look red because the car in front of me breaks I think that's the reason why but I think it's a marvelous idea because it limit myself as um, drinking Starbucks and I don't know I just feel like I just want to start budgeting more of my money but anywho I just got me a mocha frappuccino a big one with three shots of espresso <laughs> and a bacon gouda now as I was looking at my Starbucks app they got this new cinnamon swirl dessert and i should have i didn't look at it till after i ordered and i'm looking at it i said oh i should have ordered this i ordered it next season now the brake light's gone so i'll order it next time all right guys i will order the it's it's called something swirl some cinnamon swirl and it got pistachio nuts on it so next time i go to starbucks which might be maybe next week or I might <clears throat> I might just come back to Starbucks just to try it <clears throat> try the dessert with y'all and they had a new drink okay no that'll be it thank you you too I'm gonna come I'm gonna come back and try the new dessert and a new drink so I just want to try this I like to try new stuff with y'all even though I don't really drink this stuff or eat that stuff but just to let y'all know what's new in starbucks anyways got my drink so let's get on the road all right guys it is way much later i'm over my risha house now and um we supposed to be going out i mean we supposed to go work out today today is supposed to be pole dancing <laughs> Woo it's gonna be funny I'm getting ready to work for, I'm getting ready to work into the strip club, okay? Anyways, I'm hungry, y'all. All I have is popcorn for lunch, and I stopped and got me some Chick-fil-A, so I'm gonna show y'all what I got. Hold on. Okay. Got me a kale salad, grilled nuggets, my Sun Joy, which is tea and lemonade. Then I grabbed a shake. Now, um, before y'all say anything, like, oh, just dang, that is not good for a diet. No, it's not. But I wanted to try this one shake called Spice, something spice. Autumn Spice, I think that's what it was up. But they, just, but they said they ran out the ingredients, so I can't try the Autumn Spice. So since I was in the mood to try something, I thought, okay. She said, well, we got the peppermint shake. And I'm, Cause I asked, I said, what else y'all got new? She said, we got the peppermint shake. You want to try that? And I said, sure, I'll try the peppermint shake. And I said, do you got a cookie? Cause I'm going to see my grandbaby and I can't come empty handed. She said, oh yeah, we got a cookie. So I got Kai cookie. Me, I'm just trying to shake with y'all. But before I try that shake, I gotta um, 
eat some of my food. <laughs> Y'all already know I gotta eat a little something something. Can I just eat a little something something? All I had was popcorn in, in Starbucks this morning. Popcorn for lunch, Starbucks for breakfast. So I won't be going to Starbucks for the rest of this week. But let me grab, um, wait, I gotta wash my hands, hold on. This girl went and got a seafood boil without her mama. Where they do that at? I do want some. I want anything good. All right, guys, so let me just pray. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for this food about to receive. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. So it's Kai sleep? Because he sure ain't come over here and say, hey, abuela. Must be sleep. Mmm. 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 -mm. That first bite. Mmm. It is so sweet. Is he asleep? Y'all, right, for the moment you've been waiting for, okay. Now I might have to put this in the freezer, but let's taste it peppermint shake from Chick fil A. Crushed little peppermint pieces of candy in there. And it tastes just like peppermint. Mm, mm, mm. So good. I'm going to share that with her. Anyway, guys, I'm going to finish my food. Then I got to change it to my workout clothes because I got to go work out. Okay. I gotta hit the pole.
I'm back from the pole dancing and um it was fun we we had a really good time it was fun but one thing about um learning how to do the pole, pole dancing it's a lot of spinning so i got really dizzy i had to take a a, a couple breaks because i was so dizzy and i was sweating one at one point really really heavy so it does it is a good workout to have you sweating and um you will get dizzy from spinning but uh, um, but otherwise, it was really good exercise. You're you're working parts of your body that you didn't think you'll be working. Um, she said tomorrow we're gonna be really sore. Our arms. This really hurt. The fo my forearm. That was hurting. Um, we did some stretching. I'm just trying to think of some a lot of things what what we did. But anywho, next time we do pole dancing, we're gonna we we supposed to go shopping to get some shoes because if we're gonna do pole dancing, we really want to be like in the spirit of it and get some dance shoes and she told uh what well, she told me because i had on them like athletic kind of leggings she was like next time wear shorts so we're gonna have to wear short she said wear a bathing suit wear shorts wear booty shorts whatever it is but we have to have on something that our skin can grip the pole and I didn't have that. So certain moves I couldn't do today because I had on the pants. But certain moves I was able to do. But yeah, y'all, I didn't know if I was going to really like it or not. But after really doing it, and I was like, wow, this is fun. And it's crazy because at one point I thought my daughter was going to say, no, nah, we ain't going to pole dancing. Because she was texting me early. I was like, girl, my leg hurt. My leg still hurt. Should we be going? And I was like, girl, you know, you want somebody that you that you don't want nobody to discourage you. You want to be feeling encouraged, you know what I'm saying, to go. So anyways, she we end up going because I was like, I'm on my way to your house so we can go pole dancing. She was like, okay. And I um so I had went over there and changed my clothes over there because I had me a, a pair of clothes in the, in the car with me today. So I wouldn't have to come all the way home. Oh, I'm so sore and stiff. Y'all, my legs hurt so bad today. And this is the second day after working out. And my legs hurt so bad. So tomorrow, we really got a break tomorrow. And then Friday, we're going back to um to the gym. And then Saturday, we're going to do yoga. And we only want, we want to do yoga because I'm going to tell you something. Yoga is hard. And people might think, oh, you're just standing there with your back straight, with your legs crisscross. No, it takes a lot of, like, efforts to hold certain moves, to, to bend and stretch your body certain kind of ways. It's really different. And since we're working out, we're going to need yoga. Because we got to, I'm, I'm stiff. My reach is stiff. We stiff. We ain't used to working out, so... We're going to have to include yoga. And yoga is, it, it don't cost that much. So, y'all, I'm excited. We're on a whole new journey. 
I'm gonna be working out and dancing on the pole. Like, oh my God. <laughs> uh, next thing you know, I'll be working in a strip club. <laughs> Getting my coins. Big money. No, I'm just <laughs> They probably throw money at me feeling sorry because they probably feel like, girl, you need to be somewhere in the house uh, cooking and cleaning and why you in here dancing on the pole. Anyhow, I'm just playing, okay? Don't take me serious, y'all. And if I did do it, it would just been for fun or for entertainment for y'all. So don't take me serious, okay? That is not a job I want to do. I just like messing with y'all. But anyways, pole dancing is fun. If you could try it, try it. And um, anyways, I hope we encouraging others to work out. We want to um, be healthy because, you know, health is wealth. With all the health, how are we going to get to the wealth? All right? Okay. Anyway, guys, if y'all enjoyed the vlog, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, okay? Also, don't forget to hit that bell button so you can be notified of every video I upload. And if you just subscribed, welcome to the J-Riders family. I love each and every one of you guys. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.